solid sphere A is suspended by a string from a fixed support forms a simple pendulum, right? The Q factor is 200, uh, and so it says the sphere A is displaced so that the system oscillates. Discuss with reference to the Q factor the subsequent motion of the pendulum. Well, a Q factor of 200 means it's going to go 200 times before stopping, right? So you would say what the system is lightly damped, lightly. Okay, it's going to oscillate for a long time. It loses a small amount of energy per cycle. Small energy loss per cycle. Per cycle. So there we go, right? We only have two marks, but I think that, that covers them all, right? Okay. Um, then it says the support of point P is now made to oscillate horizontally with a frequency F. Describe the amplitude A and phase of relative to P when F is 2.5 hertz. Mm, let's think about this. Well, they tell you the period here, right? So let's find that frequency. Frequency is, and this is the frequency of the pendulum, right? The frequency is one over the period, so it's one over point is 2.5 Hertz so this is our, our resonant frequency this is much faster this is much slower than the um, right this is slower okay so the amplitude of course is going to be high at the resonant frequency um, and then the phase remember when it's resonant um, the phase of a relative to P a is going to lag behind a lags Looking at the answers there. Uh oh, uh oh. It's time to be in class. No, it's it's time to go to class, man. Okay. Um. So 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 there we go. Large amplitudes, resonance, and then they, they I don't see where they have phase, but the A is going to lag behind P ninety degrees, right? Because P is driving it. The driver is always ninety degrees ahead of the, the resonance system, right? And then notice that um. That that this is a a slower rate. And pendulum this would be a fast rate so the, the pendulum is actually going to want to oscillate faster than it's being driven right so it's a low amplitude because it's not the resonant phase right and then it's going to be in phase right um, and that's because if you look at the Barton's pendulums right you've got the driver the, um, the fast ones the ones that can go faster than you're driving it stay in phase the ones that are much slower are 180 degrees out of phase and the resonant one is 90 degrees Hopefully that helps.